Great Shakeout Earthquake drills encourage you to practice how to protect yourself during an earthquake. Let's learn what to do when you're near the shore. Along the shore of the ocean, you are at risk for a tsunami. Tsunamis are most often created by large undersea earthquakes or landslides that shift the water up or down, sending out waves in all directions. When these earthquakes are far away, there can be several hours before waves arrive. But when large earthquakes happen just offshore of your location, waves may arrive in a few minutes. In this situation, there are natural warning signs of a potential tsunami. One such sign is feeling strong earthquake shaking near the shore. Whether you are at the beach or in a building, immediately drop down onto your hands and knees. An earthquake is less likely to knock you over in this position, and you are a smaller target for anything falling or flying. Then, cover your head with your arms, clasp your hands around your neck, bend over to protect your vital organs. Finally, hold on. Remain on your knees, close your eyes and mouth to protect against dust and debris. Remain in this position until the shaking stops. Other natural warning signs of an imminent tsunami are seeing the ocean rise or fall unusually far, or hearing a loud roar from the ocean. So whether you feel strong shaking or observe these other signs, immediately evacuate as a tsunami may be on its way. If you are in a designated tsunami zone, follow evacuation signs to a safe place. If there are no signs, get to high ground or inland, away from the water, as far as possible. Walk quickly rather than drive to avoid traffic, debris, and other hazards. You might also be safe going to a high floor of a sturdy structure. Unlike a tsunami from a nearby earthquake, a tsunami created by a distant earthquake may not arrive for several hours. It's important to know the first wave is usually not the largest and most dangerous. The danger can last for hours, sometimes days. In this situation, the National Weather Service will issue warnings that are transmitted from your local emergency management department, tsunami sirens, broadcast media, and weather radios. If you receive a tsunami warning and are near the shore, follow the directions of emergency officials. If ordered to evacuate, take your emergency kit and get to high ground, or inland, away from the water, as far as possible. Once you reach a safe place, stay there. A tsunami is a series of waves, and the first one is not always the largest. Ocean currents can be dangerously strong, especially in harbors and coastal rivers. Do not leave your evacuation area until you hear from officials that it is safe. Learn more about tsunamis and register your tsunami preparedness activities at tsunamizone.org. Visit shakeout.org to practice earthquake safety with millions of people worldwide and to see videos showing what to do in a variety of situations.